just luckily I was able to be referred to Providence Cancer Center and Dr. Curdy. And when I got to meet him, I knew when he came in on his day off <clears throat> that I'd found a great person, not, not just a doctor, but a, a great person who obviously cares about people. From the minute I went in for my first week of treatment to the first nurse who met me, to the staff, everybody believes here. So it's just a wonderful feeling and, and they don't try to let you get down. They really try and work you through your, your tough days and, and make you think of positive things and help you think about positive things that your body's doing to kill the cancer. It reassures them that they can see somebody that has been through the treatment and you can come out the other side and it's not, um, it's a tough treatment to go through but um, there is hope and you can lead a normal life. Actually, after my first good scan, I had told my doctor that, you know, if I can ever speak with someone, I'd be happy to do it because it is, it's a, you know, a lot of people don't know about immunotherapy and they see a lot on the internet that's not always the best possible light. And it's nice when you can talk to somebody who's actually been through it. So they, you know, Providence reached out to me with different patients and I've been doing that for about six years now. You know, it is an attainable goal. The, a cure for cancer is, is really, we're on the cusp of it right now, and Providence is helping lead the way. And, and there are people who can say, yeah, I had cancer, and now I finished cancer. I always try and tell patients to believe. I have a, a hashtag of don't stop believing, and, and, and it's from the great iconic song of the 80s, and I remind people when that keyboard starts pounding and the guitar riff coming that you do believe and that it does get better and that you can get through this and that when you believe anything is possible. And immunotherapy really is the future of cancer treatments and, and to, to do it you got to believe. Providence believes, the people believe and when everybody starts believing good things can happen.